I straight up suck at coding, but the rise of AI and its assistance with coding has helped me in that process greatly. And I want to share how I went from making games like this to making games like this using tools like these. And the last thing I want to do is spend money. So all the tools I'm mentioning today are totally free. I do want to add here that having even a base, small knowledge of programming is super helpful and recommended. Anyway, here are my personal top 10 free AI tools to help you code faster while making stunning games without breaking the bank. Let's get into it. First one on the list is GitHub Copilot. GitHub Copilot is an AI powered code completion tool developed by GitHub and OpenAI. It acts like an advanced coding assistant suggesting entire lines of code or blocks based on the context of your current work. For game developers, it helps speed up the repetitive tasks, automates complex functions, and suggests improvements as you code. While there's a paid version for general users, students, and open source developers, it can be accessed for free, making it an accessible tool for improving efficiency in game dev projects. We all love GitHub. Go check it out. Next on the list is OpenAI Codex. This is super interesting because it's actually the engine behind GitHub's Copilot. It's capable of interpreting natural language into code. Game developers can use the codex to write scripts, general assets, and handle backend functionality by simply describing what they need in just plain English. This tool helps accelerate development cycles and lowers the learning curve for more complex programming tasks. While free access may have usage limits, it's a powerful tool for enhancing productivity in the early stages of development. This is such a cool tool and it kind of is self-explanatory, just how you can just ask it things and it'll help you work it through. So go check it out. Next on the list is Tab9. I'm not quite sure if I'm saying it right, but Tab9 uses machine learning to predict and auto-complete code as you type type offering suggestions that are tailored to your coding style. It integrates with many popular IDEs, making it a seamless addition to game development workflows. The free version is perfect for individual developers who want quicker code suggestions without the need of extensive customization. For game developers who are working solo or on small teams, this can reduce coding time and help focus on game design and mechanics and the stuff that we all love doing. It's fantastic. Go check it out. It's free. Next on the list and one that I have used on multiple occasions is Kite. Kite is another AI coding assistant that focuses on Python and JavaScript development. Using both useful languages and game development, Kite offers auto-completion, inline documentation, and coding suggestions, making it a valuable resource for game devs who want to streamline their coding process. While it has a premium version, the free tier is robust enough for any common code task, providing you with faster code suggestions and helping you avoid mistakes. JavaScript can get confusing for me sometimes, so having something like this is just perfect. Go check it out if you're doing something with that. Next on the list is DeepCode, and this is a sort of different assistant. De DeepCode is an AI-powered code review tool that analyzes your code for potential errors, vulnerabilities, or just inefficiencies. For game devs, using DeepCode can help maintain clean, secure, and optimized code, especially for larger and more complex projects. It's free for individual developers, making it an absolute no-brainer for solo or indie devs looking to avoid bugs and improve their overall quality of their code base by catching the issues early. Deep code saves time in debugging and refining your game. This is such a great tool to have in your tool belt because I feel like other AI generated stuff, especially like ChatGPT can kind of get lost in the weeds. This helps you avoid that. So just go check this out. It's fantastic. Next on the list is repel.it. I'm not sure if I'm saying that correctly, but repel is an online coding environment that allows developers to write, run, and collaborate on code directly from a web browser. It supports multiple languages, including Python, JavaScript, and C Sharp, all of which are useful for game development, obviously. Repellet also offers AI assistant coding and is great for prototyping game mechanics or experimenting with new features. The free tier is also perfect for solo devs or small teams, making it easy to test and share code on the fly without setting up local environments. This is just a, another alternative to ChatGPT or stuff like that. Check it out if you're interested. Might be something that you're into. Let's keep moving. Number seven on the list is 
PyTorch. Again, not entirely sure if I'm saying that right, but PyTorch is a popular open source machine learning library developed by Facebook, widely used for AI research and production. For game devs, it can be a valuable tool for integrating machine learning algorithms into your games, such as creating intelligent NPCs or complex behavior models. PyTorch's flexibility and extensive documentation make it approachable even for those new to AI. Since it's free and open source, developers can integrate cutting edge AI into their games without additional costs and making super deep and enriching NPCs like mentioned before. So go check it out if you're interested in something like that. Could be worth your time. Let's keep moving. Number eight on the list is Unity ML Agents Toolkit. That is a tongue twister. Get a better name, Unity. <laughs> but this is designed specifically for creating AI behaviors in Unity based games within the engine. This tool allows you to develop and train machine learning models to control characters and NPCs in dynamic and interactive environments. Game devs can use this toolkit to create more realistic, adaptive in-game behaviors without writing tons of complex code manually. Best of all, it's completely free and integrated into the widely used Unity engine. I use this engine myself and it makes it super accessible for game devs of all experience levels. Again, if you use Unity and you're interested in making something like this, you owe it to yourself to at least check it out. What more can I say? Let's keep going. Number nine on the list is Google Collab. Google Collab provides a cloud-based environment, much like ChatGPT, for running machine learning code and experiments without the need of a local high-end engine like Unity, Unreal, all that jazz. Game devs can use it to prototype AI models for games or experiment with procedural generation. The free tier includes ample resource for small-scale projects and Collab's ease of use combined with its super powerful capabilities make it a great choice for developers looking to incorporate AI into their games without setting up complex local environments. And with AI writing code and all that jazz, you know, I hate writing code. So this is super helpful. Go check it out again free. Finally, number 10, and honestly, probably one of the more popular ones is the Godot Engine AI plugins. The Godot Engine is obviously way popular, especially with the Unity runtime feed that has now been canceled, but Godot is free and an open source game engine, and it features a range of AI plugins that can help developers integrate advanced AI behaviors, all kinds of things into their games. These plugins support a wide variety of AI related tasks from pathfinding to more advanced decision making systems for NPCs. With full integration into the Godot workflow, these tools are perfect for indie developers looking to add some smart, responsive characters into the games, all without incurring additional costs because it's free, which is awesome. So if you love Godot, which I know many of you do, go check this out. It's a no-brainer. Sick. So that is my top 10 list. Clearly, ChatGPT is not the only AI assistant out there anymore. There are so many options that include a wide variety of different things that they offer. So hopefully this list helped you today save a little money in that bank account. If you're interested in more tools like these, I have two other lists of free tools for game devs, ranging from art to programming and everything in the middle. We also have a game coming out called Cave Masters. You can go play the demo right now and join our Discord to, again, talk about more more amazing things like saving money. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button and leave a comment below letting us know your favorite free tools today. Thank you guys for being here and I'll see you next time.